Hey everyone, welcome back to Splash. Today we are going to be talking about five hidden mistakes in Nickelodeon TV shows. Do you want to win the new iPhone 11 Pro? If so, be sure to watch the whole video, leave a like, and comment the hidden message. And with that being said, let's get right back into the video. Number five, SpongeBob SquarePants. Rock bottom. It sure is weird around here. Kinda different. Even the soil looks different. Would you mind putting me down? SpongeBob SquarePants is a silly show, but that doesn't necessarily follow conventional rules. That being said, it's perfectly clear and normal to see the character do weird things with their bodies. Does SpongeBob have bones? Or not? But in the episode Glove World, there is a mistake that is absolutely the animator's fault. For a split second, when SpongeBob and Patrick are boarding a bus, we see SpongeBob missing an arm. Now, the episode must have been difficult for the animators because there was another mistake in this episode as well. When SpongeBob arrives back to his pineapple house, it is animated differently than all the other buildings. Now, these only last for a few frames, but it is quite a strange sight to see if you catch it. I never knew you felt so strongly about this. Where have you been? Well Number four, Rugrats. I don't know, Chucky. You dumb babies, we're not gonna live here, we're on vacation. Oh, there you are, Cynthia. Oh, what's a vacation, Angelica? The Rugrats was a classic cartoon from the 90s to early 2000s. The animation style was wonderful and the basis of the show was really unique. All of that doesn't prevent the show from having a few animation mistakes, though. In the episode Vacation, the group head out to Las Vegas for, well, a vacation. In one scene, Tommy is seen wearing swimming trunks and swimmy floats on his arms. In the shot where Angelica picks him up, he is seen wearing his standard diapers and blue shirt. And then again in the next shot, the shirt is gone. It's a continuity error like this that can make audiences a bit confused when watching shows. <laughs> Number three, hey Arnold. Hey Arnold! Hey Arnold was a hit for many, many reasons. It wasn't a slapstick comedy type of cartoon. It dealt with darker issues, all while keeping it as lighthearted as possible. It was loved by children and their parents alike. This cartoon had its fair share of animation mistakes though, such as color swaps. In the episode Girl Trouble, there is an even bigger mistake though. In the episode, we see the classroom and the spot where Helga sits. She goes to sharpen her pencil and then looks back at the class. In the next shot, we see Arnold at his desk and strangely, the desks have been rearranged. Stranger yet, we even see Helga still sitting behind Arnold. I thought she was sharpening her pencil. I mean, I like Layla, but I don't like her like her. He doesn't like her like her. Oh, Arnold, so discriminating, so patient and thoughtful, spurning the gold. Number two, the fairly odd parents. 85%, 79%. What? No! Come on, pal, I'm right here. 62%, 58%. Not every mistake in a cartoon is caused by animation error. In Fairly Odd Parents, one mistake came from a factual error. In the episode The Secret Origin of Denzel Crocker, Timothy Turner goes back in time to find out why Mr. Crocker hates March 15th so much. Timmy goes back in time by increments of 10 years. Starting at 2002, he goes back to 1992, then 1982, and then 1972. Time-based errors occurred when in the 1982 segment, the writers decided to reference Flashdance, Back to the Future, and Miami Vice, all of which happened after 1982. Then again, maybe the writers were just going for more of a classic 80s feel. Number one, the adventures of Jimmy Neutron, boy genius. A super powered mind, a mechanical canine. <laughs> Rock a Jimmy Neutron. The adventures of Jimmy Neutron, boy genius, was a hit animation show on Nickelodeon. The style was unlike any other show at the time, and the humor hit all the right beats. All of this success aside, there were bound to be mistakes. In the episode The Evil Beneath, 
the writers were paying homage to classic horror movies. One big mistake that can ruin a show is a plot hole, and this episode included one. In it, the gang gets trapped in an evil lair when their hover car runs out of gas, but later on, when the time comes for them to escape, they are able to jump on board and quickly get away. The whole reason they got trapped was forgotten once it became time to escape. Maybe it's like magic gas. A simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We'll be giving away the brand new iPhone 11 Pro, so be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter the giveaway. It's really that simple. Go for it. All right, everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. While you are here, go ahead and click the links above to check out some of our other awesome videos, and I will see you in the next video.